Heading down into turn number three is the number 40 machine of Derek White, our next one. It's a real battery, Gray Floyd Dodge. And Morgan Shepard crosses the line, fourth quickest of our five qualifiers so far. 176.446 miles per hour. Derek White, as you mentioned, up on track as well. One of the drivers that was very successful in the final round of practice. There were 23 cars that took to final practice yesterday. He was third fastest behind Ty Dillon. Part-time runners in the NASCAR Xfinity Series, although he has won the restrictor plate races at both Daytona and Talladega this season. When we were here last, he came home with a 22nd place finish. Hopes to improve upon that here this weekend. Working his way between turns three and four now to get his time to lap in. Next car on track, veteran Derek Cope. A lot of good memories here at Daytona for Derek Cope, the 1990 champion of the White comes across fifth fastest at 175.488 miles per hour, so he is now in the top five. Still being shown fastest. That is Bobby Gearhart. Third is Dexter Bean, Morgan Shepard, and Derek White. The top five of the seven. Cope up to full speed here down the back straightaway. The next car released is going to be Mark Thompson. The cars will tend to get faster and faster as we go. The last car that will come out here this afternoon is going to be the guy that was fastest in the draft yesterday's practice session, David Reagan, who's driving for Joe Gibbs Racing in the Interstate Batteries Toyota. Be behind the wheel of car number 20 here this weekend. But the attention is on the start finish line. And Derek Cope brings that machine down. He will climb it uh, in, uh, let's see, fifth quickest of our seven qualifiers so far. A speed for Derek Cope, 175.960 miles per hour. The number 13 machine. This is Mark Thompson, the Phoenix Air Automobile. And Thompson, the owner of that company, also an airline pilot himself. Won the pole that day and has been running the restrictor plate races both in ARCA competition and in the Xfinity series as he is headed down the back stretch. In the turn three goes Mark Thompson. And the next man out for his qualifying run will be the number 97 machine of Peyton Sellers. Off turn four is Mark Thompson, and now he comes to the line. Let's see where he slots in. 